when you get a business owner on their path where they absolutely know this is the right thing that they're doing, they absolutely know what they're compelled to do, they absolutely know it's all very well being passionate. But you know, unless you can communicate that to your customers, they really understand what they're gonna get out of the relationship, what they're gonna get out of the relationship, it's pointless. So it's actually, when you've got that, when you really have that, then you're, re you're so motivated to go out and do what you do because you've got so much more certainty. And that's all that you know, I helped her with, but her business has, has doubled in that time. The amount of business plans I've supported companies with, the amount of bespoke strategies, whether they're large or smaller businesses, you know, your, the strategies we develop are unique to you, unique to you, your business and your customers. But this is brilliant, I love this. I use this with all of my, my clients, the Orbit tool, because it's a visual way of you um, developing your three-year plan. And it's a great way of you communicating that to the rest of your staff. It's a reminder, we bl I always blow this up and have this. Have you done this? It's amazing, isn't it? I always blow this up and have, so every time I have it do it for my business, so when I walk in I know what I'm doing, I know why I'm doing it, I know where I'm going, I know the impact it's going to have on all aspects of my business, it's a brilliant tool. Who are your most valued customers? Do that assessment in your business, really understand the customers that really do love you, you've just got to give them an opportunity to love you. And the way that you do that is get into their headspace, no one's interested about yours, if you haven't got customers you haven't got a business. So you really want the great customers, who's you know, had experience with customers, they're just a nightmare, you can't do enough for them and they're always complaining, it's because they're not your tribe of customers, they're not your 20%, they're never going to love you whatever you do, they're just costing you time and money. So really find out the tribe of people that love you and this is how you grow your business, dealing with the people that already get what you do. To get what you do, you've got to understand what you do yourself. So really kind of tap in, into that. Who wouldn't want that? I want that. Who wouldn't want that? We all want that.